Hello, viewers. This is Mr. DBZ Fan on the Daikaiju Movie Theater channel. As you guys know, this is Mr. DBZ Fan talking. I've got a haul. This is. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> something went down my throat. But anyway. So, this is something I want to do on the channel. Um, where if I just got small hauls, not collection updates, I'm going to show the hauls and then the, you know, once I have enough stuff, I'll do the collection update on my channel. So you guys who subscribe here and subscribe there will know everything before the video is actually posted. Right now I only have three things. Um, I just got two of them today at Walmart because they didn't have any, uh, oddly enough, I didn't see any Hero, not Hero Factory, um, sorry. They didn't have any uh, Halo Reach figures, which I've gone back into Reach and I'm playing Halo Reach on my Xbox a lot more. Of course I won't be on for another two weeks, but um, Love Halo Reach. Good game, good game, very good game. Anyway, so two things I got. I mean, the three things I got. First thing, of course, as you guys know, I love Show and Jump, so I got the issue two, February 2011. Yeah, not that big. Um, they're seeming as though to get more cheaper and cheaper. Like, usually they would have a bunch of stuff popping out of the top, and now it's just that. And now they're calling it issues, so. One piece issue. Let's see, the next one doesn't... Yeah, that was my dog. She's working. I don't know why. She was just out a minute ago. This is the Blue Exorcist and Tigger and Bunny issue, I'm guessing they're going to call it. The next one. Number three, which will be out sometime. So, um... Because my dog's barking, and I don't you got, don't want you guys to get irritated with that. I'll just show the next two things. All right, so they had four different Hero Factory sets, and of course I'm sticking. I was sticking to the one I wanted to get, and then I only had twenty six dollars, so I couldn't get two twelve dollar packs, which there was Split Face, Raka, Inferno. Makes me sad. I wanted to get Split Face and Raka, but. I didn't get. I didn't get split face. Yeah, that's right. I got Raka. And who else did I get? So let me show you Raka because you guys already know. Raka. 4.0. Darn it. Yep. Nope. Oh. Well, yeah. And Javelade. So I got Jablade as well. I knew I was forgetting something when I <laughs> reached over and grabbed him. So yeah, I also got Jablade. Which most people have said, or at least Lego Jan, Jan, Jang, sorry, did. He said it wasn't that good of a figure because, you know, he likes aquatic stuff and he likes them to, um, you know, be normal stuff. And then this one had arms. And, and I said this was going to be the last one when I saw that review, but now that I have it in hand, it's actually, for what it is, it's well bit, built. And it's not that bad of a figure. So, if you guys weren't going to plan on getting it, get him. He is actually really, really nice. He's a very nice figure. And then, of course, Raka, who, um, no matter what anyone says, this is probably one, this is one, this is easily in the top five best Hero Factory figures. Um, this is a really, really, really nice figure. Um, there is nothing wrong with him. He's not too fat. He's not too skinny. I, he comes with a freaking crossbow. How is, how is that not cool? A crossbow with a chain with three arrows and an energy with an energy shield. Or you can, like, do stuff, like have him shoot out an arrow or something, you know? You can make him do so much thing. So much stuff. And yes, I'm not gonna give you guys the codes. They're mine. Even though I haven't signed up quite yet. I think I'm gonna just do that after this video. So, yeah. That's it. Here's my weekly haul. Um, not the Mecha Godzilla. That's the first... That's the second video I'm gonna post on this channel. The review on him, so... Shall we jump? Issue 2 of 2012. Rock up 
4.0, job laid. See you guys later. <laughs> Tastes like metal. Bye, guys.